Therapy Sports Wall. What's going on, friends? I'm Julian Mitchell. We got a ton of section championship action on the sports wall tonight from the volleyball courts and the gridiron. We'll get started on the turf over at Mayo High School. Top seeded Spartans taking on the second seeded Owatonna Huskies in the section 1 5A title game. This one, a rematch of last year's title game. Mayo won 38 33. What will happen tonight? Spartans got this one started. Reese Grimsrud airs a beautiful ball out for the man with the second most yards in the state this season. Carter Holcomb, big grab, Mayo in business. They're in close now, let's give it to the big fella. Rudy Lazoya, touchdown Mayo, they're in front 7-0. The Huskies would march down to the red zone, play action, QB Jacob Ginsky to Jacob Strom over the middle, nice grab, they're hanging on there. Oh, it's on a Nazis puppy at seven. Second quarter now, same score, Ginsky on the boot, fires, look my one hand, tore Pappenfuss on the interception, what a play. So Mayo with it. I'm gonna hand it off to Isaiah Beal. He finds a hole and just explodes like C4 through it all the way to the end zone. Mayo back in front, 14-7. These fans are loving it. Look at them. <laughs> They'll like this too. Ginsky rolls out again, looking for something, anything. He lets it go. That's Pappenfuss. Full extension for the pick. He'll take this down in the Husky territory. Water game for this guy. So down in the red zone. They go quick fade, Holcomb, Mr. Go-Getter, just makes a play. Hey, ref, you got a touchdown? Yes, he does. Spartans went for two and got it. So it's 22 to seven. A little later, handoff again to Beal. And if Beal Street could talk, it would say Isaiah's pretty darn good. Touchdown, Spartans. They're absolutely rolling up 29 to seven at halftime. Spartans kept it rolling in the second half as Mayo wins 36 to seven, the final score. Donnie Holcomb and the Spartans repeat as section champs and now make back-to-back -back state tournament appearances. Now from Mayo High School to Mayo Civic Arena we go. Multiple section titles on the line on the volleyball court. We'll get started with the AAA championship. In this one, the third-seeded Byron Bear is going toe-to-toe -to -toe with rival and top-seeded Cass and Manorville. Comments were flying here. Look at this placement on the serve from Ares McAdams. That's an ace. KM up 7-3. And Bears go up for a big swing, but, swing, but Abby Distad and Skylar Flissick say not in our house. Big time block. Comets out to a 15-9 lead. Here come the Bears. Alexis Nelson, what a dig. And Sophia Gartner just smashes this through the block for the kill. And here Byron going to set this up for Lauren Fierstad. And watch her fly here and bring down the hammer. Sheesh. Family leads cut to 17-13. They were rolling in this one. Bears try to float this over. Whitney Denno and Sophia Sutton had two and three blocks respectively in this one. Comets take set one, 25-17. This match between two really good teams went five sets. KM won 15-12 to capture the section title. Last year's runner-ups will have another shot at the title. They're headed to state. To the AA championship next, this one a matchup between four seed Caledonia and the two seed Cannon Falls. Bombers have swept their way through its side of the bracket. So Warriors looking to come out swinging. Cena Ogdahl, Liv Meyer do just that, combining for the block there. Caledonia to an early 7-2 lead. A little later, Warriors get the block here. Cannon Falls keeping it alive, but Logan Kepke. Is, hey, we're done here. Four kills, an ace four in the set. Caledonia's up 12-6. Bombers, though, tough to put away, especially Madison Burr. A stinging kill. She had six in this set, so the lead's trimmed a bit. Then Caledonia on the swing. Fallon Fola and Rachel Miller are there for the block. Caledonia lead is down to four, 18-14. A few points later, Bombers set it up for Miller, and she brings down the hammer. Big kill. Caledonia would take set one, but Cannon Falls rips off three set wins in a row to win this match three to one. Back to state for the second year in a row. Section 1A championship. Two seed, Mabel Canton going up against top seed Bethlehem Academy. Cougars came out firing. Set it up for Kenley Soini, and she smashes this ball cross court for the kill. Mabel Canton. Out to a 14-9 lead. Next point, B.A. with a swing. But Sophie Morgan and Sweeney Ritt return that to Cinder. Big block, B.A. would need a timeout. And they'd regroup. They work it to Lindsey Hansen, who off a deflection, picks up this kill. MC leads trim to 20 to 17 now. And here the Cardinals come again. This time, Kate Trump with a heater straight to the back. B.A. is in this thing. It's 21-18. The Cougars had it going in this first set. Sweeney spikes this right on the line as Mabel Cannon took set one 25-22. This one will go four sets as Mabel Cannon went three to one. They're headed to the state tournament for the first time since 2000.
and one.